Peace, y'all. Just do what Master say. Just do what Master say. There's some good white folk. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Good white folk. Master don't like when you start talking too much. Master don't like that. No. They're good white folk. They let us play football. They let us run around and hit other people. That's a good, good white folk. So, capping it, shh. You need to cut that damn hair. You're looking a little bit too black. Now, I know you can't do nothing about your fucking skin. But you can cut that damn hair off. Because Massa don't like that. Massa don't like when we start looking too black. Massa don't like when we start talking about the things that they do to us. Massa don't like that. No, sir. No, sir. Massa don't like that. Mm -mm. Massa don't like that. So, now you know this is my interpretation of Ray Lewis. And I hate calling another black man a coon just because I disagree with him. But that's some coon shit. But, what do you expect? Ray Lewis was never a fighter for justice. <laughs> Ray Lewis was never um, stood up for, you know, black things that's going on in our community. He's a fucking football player. So, on one end, I'm not mad at him. I don't expect anything fucking different. But then on the other side, it's just sad that we're filled with so much fucking fear. So much fear, man, that we won't even stand up when it's time to stand up. And why the fuck are you kissing ass for? Didn't Massa give you a, a ring already? Didn't Massa let you play in the Super Bowl and all that shit? So, what the fuck's the problem? You know, I've argued all day with people about this. Some people say, well, you know, he's trying to say that just... Be silent so he can play football. But what's more important? You know what I'm saying? What's more important? And I'm not really sure about uh, Kaepernick. Now, I know that what he did, I respect what he did. It's his right. The funny thing about it is that no fucking body was talking about why the hell he did that. Nobody said, um, you know, it's, you know I, I don't agree with you not standing for the flag. But why the hell is he doing that? Why the hell is he not standing for the flag? Nobody said that shit. Everybody just said he ain't standing for the flag. You know, that's the thing about racism. You, tr people, you know, certain white folk try not to be racist. They think that they're actually undercover racist, but they tell on themselves with shit like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't think Kaepernick is going to even listen to him. I think he's going to, I don't think it really fucking matters. You know what I'm saying? He's a football player. He's there to do a job. And, you know, if he does go to Baltimore, where I think he's going, you know, it's a lot of issues there. We know the things that's been, that happened in Baltimore in the, in the past few years. I think he's going to be welcome there. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, Ray Lewis, shame on you, man. Shame on you. Shame on you. First it was Michael Vick. Then it's you. We scared, man. We scared. Scared of death. That's basically what it fucking is. Anyway, what you guys think about this whole shit? I just wanted to give my two cents on it. Like I said, it's sad that, you know, <laughs> people won't stand up when they should. But at the same time, we can't expect entertainers and football players and people like this to all of a sudden become conscious of some shit and stand up. Please, please. You know, he's on, uh, I think he's on Fox Network, FS1. Come on, man. He got a total line. Same thing with Stephen A. Smith. All these brothers. They're not going to, it's a, they're not going to put, it's a certain point they're going to cross that line they're not going to cross that fucking line because they don't want to disrupt their money flow and hey you got to feed your family do what you got to do 
You know what I'm saying? But when they start speaking that shit about how things are not going to change, uh, things should change in this, well, you're in a powerful position. You should fucking, you know, what the fuck are you doing? You know what I'm saying? What are you doing? You're, and I don't want to switch this to Stephen A. Smith, but he's another one. You know what I'm saying? That does shit that like, okay, like the OJ shit. You know what I'm saying? He goes on there and, and I know a lot of people know think OJ did it. I understand that shit. I, you know, I don't even, I, I some think he, he did it. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. What I do know, he went on there and blasted the fuck out of OJ. But he didn't talk shit about Mark Furman and all the fucking corruption that the LAPD was doing. But he just had to had to slash down another black man. You know what I'm saying? That's the little coon shit that I see. But, you know, we got to make Massa happy. We got to make Massa happy. They good white folk. They good white folk. We can't, we can't, we can't, you know, we can't make Massa not happy. Yes, sir. Gotta do it. So I know Massa gave me a contract for a couple million dollars. Massa good to me. Massa good to me. Yes, sir. Massa good. Anyway, y'all stay safe out there. Must <laughs> have a great night. Peace.